So, I've been testing a little Arcane Priest on the Season of Mastery PTR, and there are some weird things going on. The reason I'm revisiting it now is because it was buffed. Casting Star Shards in vanilla takes up a debuff slot, but now there are infinite debuff slots on all targets, so that doesn't matter. Also, Season of Mastery theoretically prefers mana efficiency in raids due to the increased fight length, and Arcane Priests have really good mana efficiency. To recap my first video on the subject, Night Elf Priests get a unique channeled spell called Star Shards that has theoretically the highest damage per mana value out of the entire Priest arsenal thanks to the 5 second rule. The 5 second rule says you get a lot more passive mana regeneration when you haven't been casting for 5 seconds. Haven't been casting actually just means not spending mana. So you benefit from the 5 second rule after channeling one entire cast of star shards. You can continue in this enhanced mana regeneration state by following up your star shards with a smite, holy fire, or mind blast, which are spells that charge mana at the end of their casts rather than at the beginning like star shards. However, in practice on the PTR, this only works some of the time. I'm pretty sure the meditation talent is what's causing things to work a little funky, but the problem is that even after channeling for 5 seconds, you'll get a tick of mana that's at the standard reduced rate. It's not consistent from fight to fight, so that's difficult to track down. If anyone has any insight, please do share. So the Arcane Shadow spec, Arcane Smite spec, and pure arcane specs are all not totally dominant in damage per mana efficiency compared to the basic Shadow Priest spec in Season of Mastery. I don't have precise calculations or tests done with each of these, but after doing some napkin math, I'm not optimistic about the fate of arcane priests in the Season of Mastery. So if you do try this out, then I wish you the absolute best of luck in a literal sense of the word. If they add more pre-mades for the later raids, then I may try it myself down the road, but I don't expect this direction is going to be as strong as normal Shadow, and I'd love to be proven wrong. Also, if anyone from Blizzard is listening, then please buff Star Shards in the next season. It's seriously one of the coolest vanilla DPS specs ever. That's all I got for this one, and remember, go crazy.